Hi folks, JMac here again and now I'm going to show you how to install another free antivirus program called Avast. Alright, let's open up our web browser and I'm going to type in free Avast. Now again, um, the first couple sites are avast.com, that's the actual makers of the program. Um, the reason I don't go to their sites, sometimes you have to navigate three or four clicks into it to find the version that you want. Um, I want the Avast Home Edition because it's free and it's on CNET.com. I trust CNET. I've never had a problem with them, so I'm just going to click. And it takes me right to my download. All right, there's my download. It's version 4.8, which is the newest one as of now. I'm going to hit Download Now. And I should see a little bar pop up over here somewhere. There we go. Right click, Download File. And again, I always like to save my stuff to the desktop. And there's a vast. All right, I'm going to fire that off. Run. I want English. This one takes a couple minutes to download. Let's see if I can speed this up for you. Slow down, take it. All right, then I'm going to just hit next. Uh, next. I agree. Next. And I almost always go to the this is the default location. Now, this is kind of interesting. If I hit custom, I can take off options that I don't want. Now, if I scroll down, it's just languages. Obviously, I don't want any of those, so I'm good. Now, the difference between minimal and typical is just the skin. You'll watch this little X disappear. I'm just going to hit typical. And next. And that'll begin the installation. Now, you get a pop up. Um, do you want to scan your stuff the first time? Um, I'm going to hit no because I know this is a fresh clean on the machine. If you have any, uh, I guess, notions that your PC could be infected, you'll definitely want to do this, but I'm going to hit no. And I'm going to hit restart later. The reason I'm going to hit restart later is because now I'm going to open up a vast. And I'm going to hit demo. Now for home users, the demo version, you have 60 days to register, but it's still free. So you just register your information, you get to still use it, you get updates, everything like that. Now this is just testing my memory. I could hit stop, close this out. The reason I don't restart, because the first thing I do is open up the menu, and I go to update, and I make sure that it's all updated. And obviously there were some files that I could update. You know that's a bad sign when it says this may take a while and I'm all set now at this point I'm gonna well <laughs> once this is done I'm going to uh, reboot the PC and I'll be back in just a moment all right I've rebooted my computer and I got this little welcome message I'm gonna hit OK and now I can see that my vast is working down here in the bottom so if I want to check a vast I can click on this or I can double click on this now this is just the setup program, so I can get rid of this. Ooh, you know what? Let me make sure. Here's the setup. So this is the one I want to get rid of. And this is the actual program itself. And if you want to check it, just double click. I'm going to stop the memory test and just get straight in. Boom, and there's a vast. Gives you all your information, what version you're running, blah, blah, blah. I'm going to hit update just to check for updates again. You can never, ever, ever update your antivirus program too much. All right, that's it. And again, this is J Mac. If you want to check out my website, it's myvirusremoval.com. Um, stop by sometime when you get a chance. Thanks.